All right, everyone. So here we are in the training mode. We have Faust here, everybody's favorite doctor. Um, so, like I said, we're going to be messing with his items here. Uh, and if you've seen, you may have faced a Faust online. You may have never seen him. He's not insanely popular, but um, he is played. And I don't want you guys to get absolutely destroyed by him. So here we go. We'll start here. Luckily, in training mode here, we have this wonderful uh, setting here called What Could This Be? And it'll show you all the items. So if you need a specific item, you can pick it. So we'll just go in order. First one here is bomb. And the way the bomb works is he'll throw it on the ground and it has a set duration. Um, and after that duration, it will explode. It hits both regular Faust and, um, or not regular Faust. It hits both Faust and the opponent. So yeah, you can block it. Um, and before the bomb explodes, you can hit it. So you can send it over there. So you can do something like this. You can throw the bomb out, hit it. This Faust can hit it back. So the bomb is pretty straightforward in that sense. It's on the ground, has a set duration. You smack it, it'll explode. You can combo after the bomb. So for over here like this, he explodes. Boom, got our combo. Didn't get the full thing, but you get the point. All right, on to the next item, 100 ton weight. Uh, 100 ton weight. Um, pretty simple, throws it up in the air, comes down, it's a full screen low. So, once again, you can block it, it affects both Faust and his opponent. Um, you can jump if you're in the air, you don't affect, you don't get hit by it. Um, and it also has a hitbox, so if, uh, we're really close like this, you see it has a hitbox on the way up. But it doesn't have one on the way down. Just just the low part. So if you're if you use it in like a block string, it won't have a hitbox on the way down. Just on the way up. All right. Next item is the donut. Probably the most straightforward item. Um, Faust throws a donut on the ground. The first person that touches it will get a little bit of life back. All right. So the next item here is the banana. Very similar to the donut. Um, he throws the banana on the ground, and the first person that touches it, Faust or his opponent, gets a little bit of life back. The only difference between this and the donut is it leaves this banana peel on the ground. And if you touch the banana peel, uh, you will slip on the ground. Like that. Um, you can get a combo off this, so, so if I throw this out, like that. Same thing, uh, you can block the banana peel. See, can block it. Um, just be aware that if that banana peel is on the ground and you get that life, that that, that banana peel is going to be there. All right, so this is the next item here and probably the coolest item. Definitely the most fun, uh, funny item, in my opinion. The Afro. So Faust reaches into his bag of tricks, pulls out the Afro, and just like every other item, the first person that touches it now gets the Afro. What the Afro does is it extends their hitbox vertically, so um, it makes them a lot taller and it gives Faust a lot, or, or the opponent, it gives them a lot more mix-up options, right? So I had to switch it to um, Soul here because Faust crouch animation, he's so low, it's hard for him to actually like uh, take advantage of this. But like I was saying, the first person to touch the Afro it's the afro and now it gives faust access to like instant overheads like that now another aspect of the afro is let me change soul here is moves that inflict fire will set the afro on fire and then after a little duration it will um detonate so like this Let's send the block real quick. So the afro is on fire, and then after a set duration, the afro will um, ignite and kind of explode, just causing another hit. So that's just another thing to think about. If you have moves that do fire, so um, let's try Soul's DP here, or let's try Gunflame. Alright, so 
let's take Soul's Gunflame here, right? If I get the acro here, you see it gets that extra hit. I can block it and it still does the same effect. So just something to think about. If you have a move that does fire, um, high fireball, things, things of that nature, um, and they get the afro, they get extended hitbox upwards, so you get a lot more overhead options. Um, and you get that extra bit of block stun, so you can extend your pressure with moves that inflict fire. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention here is Faust has a command grab here, right? 236S. Um, and if he lands with it, it gives you a nice little haircut and he'll put you into the afro state. So just be aware of that. If you land into into um, this command grab, know that you're gonna have the afro and you're gonna get uh, that extended hitbox vertical. All right, so next item here is probably Faust player's favorite item to get. It's the meteor. Pretty straightforward, right? This is this move affects faust like alone it, it doesn't uh there's really no downside to, to getting this item if you're a faust player right all it does is he throws the meteor in the air and a bunch of fireballs come down on the opponent just like so um allow, allows faust to uh run in and get his pressure going clouds the screen a little bit so he can go for like some cheesy mix-ups all right next here we got a little bit of an interesting item the mini Faust. So, uh, as you see, Faust throws down a mini version of himself, and it'll walk towards the enemy. If the enemy jumps over it, he will turn around and follow him. And as you saw right there, when when the enemy touches him, uh, it goes into this like enraged state, waits a second, and then jumps at him. If he gets hit by it, just does a couple hits, keeps him on the ground. Faust can combo off that. Um, the mini Faust cannot hit Faust. It will interrupt your opponent's combo. So if I do something like this, if I go like this, if I throw the Faust down, you see that? It's like a free combo breaker. So if, if you see your opponent throw the Faust and you, you think, oh, you're going to punish, well, guess what? That baby Faust has his back, and it's going to break that combo. That being said, you could super if you can react fast enough, but that is uh, extremely difficult to do. The mini Faust here, um, it reacts to not only you walking into it, you can also hit it to set it off earlier. So if I go like this, and I throw the Faust out, I can kick it and try to jump over it, something along those lines. Um, he will he will go away after a certain amount of time, so you can like try to uh, try to time him out, and he will go away. All right, next item is trumpet. This is probably the best item if you're not Faust. So if if I'm Soul here and I see Faust throw that trumpet. I'm going to do like everything in my nature to get that trumpet. The way this works is the first person to get the trumpet gets a gaggle of mini Fausts to run after him, right? So if I just throw out all these trumpets and I grab them all, there come a thousand mini, mini Fausts, right? The mini Fausts will come and it'll only hit the enemy. It doesn't, it doesn't affect you at all. So I get this, right? And you can do a lot of stuff with this, right? It, you can combo after it, right? Right, so I comboed a little bit. Um, same thing with the soul, right? So if I'm here. So a strategy with this is um, if you get the, if you get the, the trumpet here, a lot of times they're gonna jump, right? Cause they don't wanna get hit by the Faust. And then you can just look for an anti-air. All right, and last but not least here, last item is the hammer. Um, hammer is very similar to the one, one ton, 100 ton weight. 
The only difference is um, it doesn't have a full screen low hitbox, but it does hit on the way down and it bounces once and it'll hit once off the bounce. So the way you see it, he throws it up, comes down, bounces once, and it'll either hit on the way down like that, or it can bounce once and then hit off the bounce. So it's a really good tool to like set up a safe um, entry from Faust. And yeah, it's just a really good item overall. It doesn't, doesn't have anything, doesn't affect Faust at all. He gets a free entry with it pretty much. He needs it to zone. All right, well, that's all of Faust items. Uh, I hope this was helpful and for people both learning to play Faust and getting destroyed by other Faust players. I hope this will uh, help you learn how to deal with Faust items better, know when to go in versus what items, and when to just try to hold that block button and play a little bit more defensive. Thank you for watching, and I will be back again next time. Peace.